Academy, this is the part 2. Hello, good morning all of you. Welcome to Lecture Academy. This is the part 1 of Human Reproduction. In this part, we are going to learn introduction of human reproduction. Human reproduction is a type of sexual reproduction resulting in uh, conception of a child because of sexual intercourse between a man and woman. And the reproductive events in humans include formation of gametes, and that means formation of sperms in males and formation of ova in females. The transfer of sperms into the female, the second uh, reproductive event is the transfer of gametes into the female genital tract, female reproductive tract into the vagina of the female, that is called insemination. The third step is fusion of male and female gamete, that is called fertilization, syngamy, and leading to because of fertilization, what is formed a diploid zygote is formed. Here there is a okay fusion of gametes. Okay, both gametes are haploid, okay, the, which consists of 23 chromosomes in each one. That would result in the uh, formation of zygote which consists of 46 chromosomes, 23 pairs. Okay, this is followed by formation and development. The zygote develops into morula, next morula into blastula. And formation of development of blastocyst and its attachment to the wall of the uterus that is called implantation. And next one, once the embryo gets implanted to the wall of the uterus okay the entire embryonic development takes place there okay embryonic development that is called gestation pregnancy period and the delivery of the baby after the uh, uh, full development of the embryo okay, the baby comes so that is called parturition delivery of the baby all these reproductive events occur after puberty sexual maturity the first occurrence of maturation of in girls there are remarkable differences okay, in the reproductive events of males and females. The reproductive events are not same. For example, gestation in, occurs in female, parturition in female, implantation in female, fertilization occurs in the female, but formation of gametes occurs in both male and female. Formation of gametes occur throughout life in male human beings, in the even in old men, the sperms are formed, but the formation of ova stops at around the 50 years of age. Okay, now let us talk about what is given in NCR textbook in introduction part. Okay, as you are aware, humans are sexually reproducing, humans are sexually reproducing and they are VV paras. The reproductive events in humans include 1. Formation of gametes, 2. Transfer of gametes, 3. Fusion of gametes, okay, 4. Formation and, uh, formation and development of blastosis and its attachment to the uterine wall. And next one is embryonic development and final one is delivery of the baby that is called parturition. Humans are sexually reproducing and VV paras give birth to young ones. The reproductive events in humans include one formation of gamete that is called gametogenesis that is forms in males and ova in females. Ovum every time one ovum is released. The second one is transfer of sperms into the female genital tract that is called insemination. And the third one is called fusion of male and female gamete that is called fertilization leading to formation of zygote. This is followed by after fertilization then there is a implantation formation and development of blastosis and its attachment to the wall of the uterus that is called uterine wall. And embryonic development that is called gestation and delivery of the baby is called parturition. Okay, next one. These reproductive events uh, occur after puberty. There are remarkable differences between the reproductive events in males and in the female. For example, sperm formation continues even in old men. Okay, that means there are some differences in the reproductive events of males and females. One, one difference in sperm formation continues to occur even in old men. But formation of ovum stops, ceases in women around the age of 50. Okay, those are the differences between males and females in terms of formation of gametes. Okay, that's the first part, uh, introduction part of human reproduction. Okay, in the next part, uh, we will talk about uh, human male reproductive system.